we are entering the era of EV tolls. You may call them flying cars or flying vehicles. Or you may refer to them as personal aircraft. Many engineers now say that this is the future of transportation. Apparently, the flying passenger drones will change the way we travel, but not today and certainly not tomorrow. Many companies are now investing money in the sphere of urban mobility. Obviously, aviation companies won't stay aside and look at the new aircraft market slipping out of their hands. Airbus presented their first EV toll project quite long ago, Boeing introduced a new company called Boeing Next. And Embraer, a Brazilian company, has also introduced their vision of new urban mobility. Today we'll look at EVE, the project that belongs to Embraer and Boeing and is one of the most prospective and technological. So, EVE is actually a concept of a future air taxi and urban mobility solution. The company works hard to create their first prototypes and also to introduce a new system of sky management in cities. Everyone understands that the myth that anyone can be a pilot is not realistic at all. So people will need automated solutions to control those drones in the sky and prevent them from crashing into each other. And Embraer is one of the first companies to actually create such control system. Initially, EVE was a piloted aircraft. And the company is considering to have this feature as an option. But for commercial use, the EVE drones will be all autonomous. So, how will the Embraer's EV toll be different from all those other projects that have already been presented? The system will rely on eight horizontal propellers, placed on four wings. Those propellers will control the altitude and will complete landings and takeoffs. But you can see two more vertical propellers that look much more powerful. Those ones will ensure forward movement with much higher speed than the majority of existing passenger drones. This design helps engineers achieve maximum comfort for passengers. The aircraft will always stay in the same position without having to lean forward to go faster. Those two powerful propellers will ensure quite decent speed. Also, the wings will make the aircraft fly like a plane for better safety and fuel efficiency. The aircraft is going to be capable of transporting four passengers plus their luggage. The service ceiling is said to be around 1,000 meters or 3,300 feet. Naturally, they introduced the feature of propulsion distribution. If one or two motors fail during the flight, the system will redistribute the propulsion to safely land the aircraft. We don't know the cruising speed and range, but we can presume that the EVE will be one of the fastest EV tolls in the sphere because it has wings to rely on. It's also going to have bigger range than its competitors, thanks to the wings and cleverly organized propulsion system. We hope to see piloted test flights soon, and we are going to update you when something important happens in the sphere of EV tolls. So subscribe to Technical Evolution channel and stay updated.